Hey guys, got a video here for the Tooltip Blitz 19 for the any of the YouTube Machinist group. <clears throat> I'm going to show. I have a little tip here for when you're drilling repetitive holes that all need to be to the same depth. Realistically, you could also use this like if you just had a straight manual machine with no DR or anything like that, and you just wanted to make sure you were pretty close to the right depth. Now, because I'm going to show this a couple of ways. The way I normally do this at work is on a bridge port, and I have a depth quill stop, quill depth stop, right here, which a Grizzly G0704 apparently does not. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to base this just off the end of my quill travel. See, I stop right there, and then I'll kind of explain how you do it with a bridge port, <clears throat> a bridge port style. Anything with a quill stop, it doesn't matter. If it has a quill stop, it'll work this way. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull this down to my quill stops, and then I'm going to lock it. There we go. <clears throat> then I'll turn my DRO on just for kicks and giggles. Okay. So then I would come down till I touch. What I would also do is make sure my drill chuck is tight so that my drill bit's not sliding up in my... There we go. That'll work way better. Let's try it again. So I'll come down and touch. Right there. See, we're touching. So, let's zero out our... Now what you do here, I'm zeroing out my DRO. You just zero out your Z or your knee travel. So we're as far down as we can go. If we have a cool stop here, we'd be sitting on it. So we can't go any lower. Make sure that the travel in your quill, when you see if you set a quill stop, is at least how deep your hole is going to be so you don't run out of travel. So we're all the way down. We're touching here, and we're zeroed here. So now let's let this thing go. Let our quill go up and get out of the way. Now what we're going to do is you would either raise your knee, or in my case, lower the head, the depth we want to go. Oops, there we go. So let's say we want to come down, or let's say we want to drill our hole quarter inch, so we want to come down 250, or go up 250, whichever direction your case would be. Oops, a little farther. Then go ahead and lock your Z, whatever your Z travel is. So now, see when I come down, see I'm touching early earlier than when I was at the end of my travel or before you're at your stop. And it stops. So then, if we were doing repetitive parts, like say we had a stop here, and we were just pulling parts out, changing them over, as long as your this distance here is the same, you're going to end up at the, you're going to end you're always going to end up at the same depth off the bottom of your vise or your whatever surface you zeroed off of. Okay, so I think I explained that. If I lift out a part. Leave me a comment. I can always redo another video and shoot it a little bit better. But literally, all you can do is come down and touch it off. Lock your, set your stop, whatever your, whatever method you have to use to Z-stop. To Z I might make a quill stop for this in some way, shape, or form. Something that mounts on the side of the case or something. I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, stop it where you've got enough travel for your quill. Then get your, Then let your quill come up out of the way. Adjust your Z until you are run it up, run it up or down, whichever the case is, the depth that you need to go. And then every time you run your quill down, once you're locked there, every time you bring your quill down, it'll be to the same spot. Now, obviously, they've got these little ones up here, but it, this uh, for repetitive. I mean, I've had plenty of times where I was drilling using one of these little ones right here mounted on there, 
and right about the time you get there it just kind of sucks in a little bit and then you've gone 10 or 15 a little just a little bit too far it happens to me all the time maybe i just suck i don't know anyway there you go so give that a try guys thanks see ya